Nacho! Yes, this is Dwight K. Schrute. This is the government of the United States. Say that again? There has been a mutation of the COVID-19 virus. Everyone is now dead. Everybody? Everybody. You're our only hope. Do you understand? I understand. Do you understand? I understand. Yes, sir. You can count on me. Bye. Bye. Did you see what happened? I can't believe it. <laughs> All those people, what, I wonder what happened to them. Oh, when I saw them. It didn't bother me at all. Why? I've been preparing this for my whole life. Survival of the fittest. We all know that. And I am the fittest of the fittest. Being alone doesn't scare me. I love to be alone. If I had my way, I'd be alone all the time. But turns out everyone else is alive, so. I guess, uh, I guess I'm not alone anymore. So, Dwight is taking this whole COVID thing way too seriously. Way too seriously. And he always talks about how, out of all of us, he would be the, one, the only one to survive an apocalypse. So, we decided to put that to the test. But do you think we took it too far this time? You know, I think we took it just the right amount. And that call from the government? Genius. The government. My friend from T-Mobile that owed me a big favor. Wish I could have thought of that myself. Well, I have my moments. Wait, did anyone tell Oscar it's over? Serious? What's wrong, HR? The CDC just came by and handed me this long list of things that now we're required to do every day with the employees. Wow, that does look like a lot. Are you sure you want to do all that? I mean, not really. What is this all about, anyways? Seriously. Dwight, what do you need now? I, I, I gotta read this. I want the job. Uh, what job? The CDC job. The CDC agent. I CDC want... agent job. You want to go work for the CDC? I want the CDC job here. The HR got today. CDC job here. Correct. Okay, so you want a CDC job here in our office. I want the CDC agent job here. Correct. No, Dwight. No, you, there's there's no CDC agent job. There's there's nothing for you. you can, can can you just shut the door? I was built for this. What do you mean you were built for this? Because you're wearing the silly mask? No, I was made for this. This is right What do you mean? Alley. Right up your alley? Correct. Okay, what does the job consist of? Like... It's, it's maintaining excellence in the workplace through sickness. Okay? Maintaining excellence in Correct. the workplace through sickness? Correct. Okay, if you're sick, you should stay home. 
Right, like it's, we already have a policy. Do I need to show you the policy? We already have a CDC policy here. We're all good to wait. Seriously, no. You know, there's no job here. I want the job. Okay. You know, pretty much the only difference between me and Donald Trump is I don't like to say the words "you're fired," like "you're fired," "you're fired." <laughs> I don't like to say those words. So, unless you want to hear me say those words right now, I would suggest you just go find HR and make, maybe there's a misunderstanding here or something because I don't know what you're talking about. It's not a misunderstanding. I want the job. Excuse what do you mean you want the job? The CDC agent job. It's right here. CDC packet. Okay, I'm, I'm reading the CDC packet job. You read the first page. Okay. Oh, oh, the next oh page. okay. Where does it say anything about the job? It's within the HR. It's oh, under HR. Okay, so somebody has HR. to. Correct. So it's not, this is not a CDC a agent job. job, right? job. Okay, so you want to check people. Absolutely. So you want to be the, the people checker? Correct. Right, okay. Here in our office. I mean, I want to be that man. Okay, um, no, it's just not going to work. Please, please, my please. Dwight. Man. Please. All right, fine. Please. Just, just, just go. It's fine. Thank you. Thank you. Take Thank the you. job. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Jim, what time were you heading out on our sales appointment today? Hey, Jim, what time were you heading out on our sales appointment today? What time are we heading out on our sales appointment today? You're going to have to speak louder, son. What time are we heading out on our sales appointment today? What? What time are we heading out on our sales appointment today? Oh, yeah. I heard him the whole time. Did HR send you the CDC document? Did HR send you the CDC document? No. How do you download the CDC document? Did HR send you the CDC document? I should have known that when Dwight had the conversation with me earlier about the CDC agent coming by, that he would have some master plan. I just was told to make a badge for him with the word, the letter CDC on it, and this is just not going to end well. You ha he's going to be going around to all the employees and asking them personal questions, like, do they have symptoms, their temperature, knowing Dwight, probably, what ethnicity is their mother? What, who, you know what I mean? I don't know, it's just gonna be awful. I, I don't know why anyone didn't ask me my opinion on whether or not he should be granted this position. I can just see everything going up in flames. Then you're going to subtract from that your cost of goods sold, so what it costs you to it's a pull. run your company. CC, I'm taking this meeting over. Thank you. Hi, right, everybody. There's a new agent in town. Okay? Who's the new agent? We've never had an agent before. Jim? Okay. You don't want to mess with me at this point. Okay. A couple things. All right? Uh, so first of all, as I said, I'm the new CDC agent, okay? And uh, we've been having some problems, and I'm going to take care of these problems right now. Sounds serious. Is this a joke to you? Do you think, do you think death is a joke, Jim? Do I look like I'm smiling? Just, just as seriously as you are. Okay, all right. We're, you're this close. You're this close. All right, we're going to get into things, okay? So first of all, uh, we've been having an issue with toilet paper, okay? So, one of you in this room thought it was funny to swipe all the toilet paper. Alright, so moving forward, 
the new policy for uh, screening is every day I'm going to be standing at the door checking people in. We'll be checking temperatures and we'll be asking questions about cough and sneezing and, and social distancing. Anybody who would have been around somebody who has been sick or has even thought of being sick, we're going to find out right then. So I have actually, I have a question about the employee screening. Okay. Um, when we are lined up mm -hmm. in the morning, <coughs> when, when we're lined up in the morning, Do this for your own good. Do this for your own good. Do this for your own good. Do I, do you even know if this COVID stuff is gonna work? Jim, are you serious? Of course. I've changed the entire company. I have complete buy-in. Everybody wants to be in this. I think actually this could be really big for my career. Hold I on, hold on. Do we even this. do we even know where we are? Where where are we right now, Dwight? I this none of this looks familiar. I thought you said you've been to this sales call before. I don't know. Did you take the wrong turn? This doesn't look familiar to me. This seems like it's your fault. Wow. So what was with you rolling outside your house? Oh, you saw that? Well, I told Dwight I had a few symptoms coming on and he told me to stay home. Uh, really, I just have a crew competition coming up. Um, I think that excuse will come in handy again. Time starts now. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five. What are you doing? There was not enough time to lather your hands. Fact, more diseases are spread by the unwashed hands than any other thing. You're so disgusting. Hurry up. Can you spray? Jim, you have to understand, Mom. Oh, I'm Hannah. No, you're not. Sure. All right, have you or anyone you've been around experienced coughing? No. Sneezing? No. Nobody. Nobody has coughed or sneezed no. around you. I have clear sinuses. Okay, I sneeze twice a day. I'm never sick. Whatever. All right. Have you or anyone around you experienced a fever? No. Okay, have you or anyone had loss of taste or smell? No. Okay, I don't believe this. All right, I need to take your temperature. Take it then. Looking for this, Dwight? Whoa. Pam, I think... Pam, don't do this. Oh, don't. I think we should check your temperature like you've checked ours every day I... and asked all the questions. It's happening. It's happening to me. I it's don't get sick. It's I don't get sick. It's for your own good. It's okay. I'm no. here to Pam. help you. Oh! Pam, no. It happened. Uh, you might want to check that? I don't, I don't trust you. That's not right. No way. I've never been sick in my life. How could I fake this? You're Pam. You fake things all the time. All right. Michael? I'm, I'm telling HR. I knew it was a bad idea for Dwight to be given this position. Unbelievable. I just got notified that we have to shut the entire office down until further notice because now Dwight is sick and he got everyone else sick. Thanks a lot, Dwight.